Okay, Foley, so both from an individual level and a team level, how would you evaluate 2020? Uh, 2020 in terms of this season, you know, obviously we all know it's been, uh, it's been pretty rough. You know, um, everybody involved in this building has, has seen a lot of adversity this year. But one thing that I admire about every single person is that we all steady came back to work and, and tried to just continue to fight. That that's 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 one of the things that I admire the most about these guys is that they didn't flinch, you know. They didn't flinch. They didn't cringe. There wasn't any "woe is me" attitude, you know. It was about all right. Look, this is what it is. How do we get better and how do we grow? And and that's what I loved about this team this year. Foley, what about you? How do you how would you evaluate your play this season? Um, my play, uh, I felt like I did some good things this year. Um, I feel like there's a lot of areas that I need to grow in. Um, I felt like I was able to show that I could continue to do uh, some good things. And, um, you know, most importantly, man, what I love the most about my play this year is that everyone else around me was flying. So and we were all feeding off each other, you know. Uh, I was feeding off them and, you know, I'm pretty sure, and you know what I mean, that they were feeding off me and, you know, it's like everyone is like one for 11, you know, we're all doing the things that we need to do to play as hard and as fast as we can. You know, when you look at this Jets defensive line, including yourself, there's a lot of young players. I mean, you think about you, Nathan Shepard in the same draft class. Then you talk about guys like John Franklin Myers, who put himself on the map this year. Quinnen, of course. When you look at this group fully, what do you like about the foundation in which is being set along the D-line? Um, What I like about this group and, and really just, you know, the entire defense, because, you know, just playing on the defensive side of the ball is, you know, the work doesn't stop for them. It's always figuring out, okay, what to do, how to do it, where to go, how to get it done. And we just take that mindset and we take it into work. And it, and more times than not, despite our adversities, it shows up in games that, all right, look, we're going to keep fighting. And, you know, and this is what I respect the most about this, this group is just that uh, we held each other accountable. We helped each other. We competed with one another. And it was also a foundation that Steve left for us. It kind of just kind of just continued on, you know. When you look at where you came in as a rookie, as someone that uh, you were active for like a single game, I believe, your rookie year. Yeah. And then you put yourself on the map last year and then you take another giant leap forward this year. When you look back at your rookie year to then last year to now, are you like how proud are you of the way that you've grown and developed in the NFL? Uh, to be honest, I'm very proud, especially because um, from my upbringing and uh, how I've grown up, you know, I understand that the blessings are not, that they're blessings for, you know, for me. And I understand that my grace and my gratitude is not for me alone. You know, I understand where my faith lies. So that's a very big thing for me. And I'm just proud of how far I've been able to come in. You know, just understanding that each day, you know, just continuing to work and having faith and having hope that things will get better. And, you know, understanding that, all right, your promises are going to come eventually, you know, just keep working, keep working at it. And I'm proud of myself, you know, although the work doesn't stop, doesn't mean I'm satisfied. I still have to get better. I understand I have a lot to get better at, but it's good to just sit and understand that, okay, you've taken some steps. How many more steps can you take now? All right. Well, Foley, you take that smile into the offseason. Congratulations on another NFL season in the books and enjoy your time off. Thanks, man. Appreciate it.